The puppies turned 10 weeks old yesterday and most of them are going home today. I'm in Spokane right now. I'm just waiting for uh, one of my puppy pickups and I wanted to talk to you a little bit about socialization. But before I do, I want to say the first three days that you have your new puppy, I really don't recommend socializing them or inviting company over or doing any type of training with them because they just need to get their bearings, learn their new space, you know, learn their new family and kind of gain some confidence um, with the big life changes that are happening for them right now. But after that, um, the socializing of your puppy is probably one of the best and most important things that you can do for your dog in the next two weeks. The critical socialization period is from zero to 12 weeks old. Some people will say even 14 weeks old, but I wanted to explain what socializing really means. So when you socialize your dog to something, they have to choose to do it on their own. You can't force them to do something and have it be a positive effect for them. They need to choose to do it to gain confidence from the situation and then when they choose to do it you would reward their bravery with praise or treats or whatever so what i mean by that is if you want your dog to love the lake it would be a terrible idea to take them to the lake and throw them in the water as humans we think i'll just throw them in the water they'll see that it's not that scary and then they'll they'll like it but it really has the opposite effect because it creates fear and then they'll always think that they can't trust you around the water and they can't trust the water because they were frightened when you threw them in. So you have to set up these socialization you know, experiments in a way that it looks inviting and then give your dog the opportunity to choose whether they wanna interact with it or not. So a lot of good things that you can do for socializing, really just like being out in the world would be to like take your puppy to the library or, you know, somewhere safe. I would say at this point, it's probably not a good idea to take your dog to a dog park or a pet co and let them walk around on the ground. But UC Davis did a recent study that shows that after one vaccination, a week after one vaccination, it is relatively safe to have them out and about. And I think that the benefit really outweighs the risk at this age because this is the only time in their life where they're going to be able to have single event learning. So with an adult dog, like if you were to rescue a dog from the shelter and they were afraid to be in a vehicle, you know, it could take 70 good happy, you know, non-stressful uh, times in the vehicle before they, before they accept it and say, yes, this is good. This is safe. This is okay. But with a puppy in the critical socialization period, they can oftentimes with just one positive experience, accept something as being good and safe. So when we socialize the puppies, which I have done a lot of socializing with these puppies already, what we're doing is creating a dog that is an adventure seeker, a dog that knows that something might be intimidating and it might be a little scary, but it can also be extremely rewarding. And by doing that, we prevent our dogs from being high anxiety, um, high anxiety dogs or dogs usually that will end up biting and things of that nature because they're afraid. And that's the only way that they can convey what they're feeling. So. That's my two cents on the socialization. Go out and do something new with your puppy every day.